reading the comments pigeon chest uh this map's looking great already very excited to see what level 10 he's uh in re referencing the assassin's guild uh also would you mind if i made a submission to reading the comments brighton the half-baked lore i have is the nuclear power plant was built in the tundra to keep the plant from melting down Unlike normal water cooling nuclear power plants, this one has power output far greater and requires obscene amounts of coal to work. <laughs> Needless to say, the power plant is being used to clone and mutate Code Red Mountain Dew into nuclear Baja Blast. <laughs> Protect the integrity of your son and save him from this evil menace. He is so overheated and he is crying like a baby. Gore on it in Majora's Mask. There's some uh, Link uh, Zelda lore for you. Um, well, if that's the case, I gotta bomb this reactor to hell. And uh, I gotta bring in more bombs we're just gonna be booming oh yeah this thing is producing just heavy amounts of uh did he put the did you put the white oh yeah he did he snowed this all up man i want to go to the top of that so i'm going to real quick Here we go. That's kind of wild. That that gets you a little bit. You're looking up for these. And I think... I bet this actually has killed someone. You'll have to let me know. I know that's more for like slowing people down. But this looks really nice. This is creepy. And they fixed this, right? Yeah. Yeah. The sound is really ominous. And he managed to make it moldy, which is great. You know, these with some blood lapping. Oh, wait, did this, does this move with it, though? No, it moves over it. No, it kind of does. Oh, yeah, it does. It actually... That's kind of hard to say. All right, sorry, I'm getting a little distracted. Apologies. The cold is doing things. Oh, shit, the icicles come down from these? Wow. This looks really nice, dude. Good, good showcase here. Oh, that's not... Oh, my God. That isn't a crossbow. Oh, you hear that? Oh, shit. There's an assassin up in this. Ah, yes. See the remnants of the old Code Red slowly being converted into Baja Blast. Ah, okay. Got a really strong vibe to it, I will say. Oh, did you see that? This actually... There's like cold... What is that from? Is that just the biome? You hear that? There's also some horror going on here. There's like puffs of snow. Or cold, I guess, for lack of a better descriptor. And that music. Yo, this is a really creepy biome. I'm here for it. Goodbye. Yeah, harnessing the warmth. And turn my son into something he's not. I'll try and change my son. There's nothing wrong with him. He's perfect. This code mood. Co code mood. Bouton bread. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely digging the vibe you created in here. Code mood fountain bread. Is that what I said? <laughs> Trying to recreate. Wow. And he has him facing the other way. So when you walk up, he's cloaked. And it kind of freaks you out. That's pretty clever, dude. Yo, this music coming in and out. It's kind of fucked up. In a really good way. Man, he made this really snowed over. Looks great. Holy shit, dude. Season 3 is going to be crazy. I do believe. Oh, we're going to get some droppers out of here. 
Yeah, you know what? No fall damage. I think we're getting company. And this... Oh, did you get to see him drop in? Yeah, I think you do. Oh! Oh, shit, that's a problem. Okay. Oh, my God. Watch this. Oh! <laughs> New plan. Reset. Um, this is amazing, but uh, we are, we're going to be doing something special. Wipe everything that happened. We're going to go in like, this is brand new. Now that we know what kind of glory awaits us, there's only one thing to do. It's time to bring out Old Blue. Randy Shinbone. Um, and a snow shield. Yeah, it matches. It's all about matching. Uh, we'll keep the grenades, because I think we can do some fun stuff with that. Uh, this is a great base. Thematically, it looks great. I mean, obviously, he's, you know, tongue-in-cheek in, -cheek in the, <laughs> the the Mountain Dew Code Red turning into Baja Blast, but outside of the joke itself, this looks like... I don't remember you, dude. Where did you come... I, I wonder why I didn't trigger him last time. Right down to these sheets with, like, the mold, and this just looks like a a plant that's been left derelict. These icicles on this are really cool. I know it's, like, a small touch, but it's cool they included that in the biome. It feels cold. All the sound, the cues, and even the eerie, you know, I'm curious to see what this is, by the way. Gotta remember that, um, oh, right, there's a couple of these fellas. Just in case that one got it off in time. Let's let him fire and then I'll go after his legs. We'll get his buddy. Oh, he moves around. So see. Okay, chop chop. We're gonna see some cool shit in your base, Pigeon. I'm excited. And you might have figured out what that's what that is already. But once we pull the, wasn't he right there last time? Man, I got now I'm getting like thing vibes from this. Is it further up or? No, it's not. I just like missed him somehow. I love this like frozen reactor. Now is this the like? Oh yeah, they dump right out of here. That's cool. Um. Uh... Oh, yeah, look at this all transforms. Yeah, that's very cool. All right, stand by. I got to get my uh, thinking cap on. Harvey, run. You boys ready to fight? I don't know if this was a good idea. Oh, you got assassin on the ground too. Shoot. Okay. It's the shotguns I gotta watch out for. Ooh, get, a get away from them. Oh man, that's a perfect spot, pigeon. Oh. Dubs right there are like actually amazing. Why am I, what? Why am I hearing assassin there? Oh, this is cool. Oh, come on. No! Oh! Look at this guy just eyeballing me. Did he laugh? Did you hear that? Oh! Just went right into the drink there. Wow, dude, that is pretty goddamn fun. With the, the assassins, I actually heard... I wonder if there's more locked up there, and that's why I was hearing it up there. I'm... 
I feel like one got... No. Man, then the assassin sounds just go for a really long distance. I love your housing hopper here. Just pours the dudes out. Got some glory hole vibes. Um, yeah, and with the floating, I wonder if using the, the the shooter actually with the float is maybe more fun. I may do that. Again, I don't want to become reliant on it, but. Okay, so that's to keep you in there fighting. Yep, makes sense. Now. Oh, shit. Well, that... I got... I lucked out with that. There's nothing skilled about how I avoided that at all. It was just dumb luck. I think if that... Well, I guess I would have shielded. In this case, I think I would have had the answer, but... With my normal kit, I think that would have been a problem. Yeah, top marks on this one, Pigeon. Look at even this incorporated in. I obviously, um, I love the joke. Th oh. Can you fucking believe that? Ah, oh, that's crazy. Oh, sh I suddenly was like, oh, God, and I never cleared that, so is that going to bang me? Um, <laughs> that's great, dude. That's just, uh, that's pure comedy. Well, what I was going to say <laughs> is, uh, Obviously, he made a joke about the base and, and kind of making a fun little narrative, but ultimately, this is a really good-looking base that functions as well as uh, forms. Man, those fire fast. Although, it alerts you, but it still takes a little bit of time to charge up, you know? Let's see if there's a better example of that. Oh, he comes from down there. Right, 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 right. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Did he, did he murk himself? Wait, wait. I'm going to try something here. Whoop. No, don't do that. Can I bait you? No, you're a little too smart, huh? What about, like, here? Okay. I like that. It's good to learn what you can do with those dudes. Yeah, all the frozen kind of rust spikes in here. This is cool. Thought I saw something there. Really impressed with this biome in general. Looks really, really nice. your limitations I really thought I hit that shield in time oh what a dumb all right check this out I'm sorry I'm taking so long but also like not it's cool we're gonna try something even different -er. oh I don't have the float on the okay well I still want to go in with the bolter I want to kind of the floating was cool I wanted to experiment with it but I want to ultimately go in and we're gonna, we're gonna jackknife this. Don't die right off the bat, please. I'm getting progressively worse as this base goes on. Which is a good sign. Wait, isn't there another assassin behind me? Oh, you know what happened? I spent too much time outside. I climbed up and that assassin came in. He's on a timer. That's what it is. Ah. <sighs> Okay, we're figuring it out. Slowly but surely. All right, we'll bypass this. You got two guys in here. Uh, nope. Next, next room to the right. Machine culting it up, trying to convert my son into Baja Blast. They will pay the bolt price.
And I haven't really explored around the gen mat because I'm a little too scared to stay in there because there's just so many things that can mess me up. And I'm worried that as he releases all those dudes from the hopper, um, I'm going to get stuck in there fighting. And I wonder if that's his intention, but maybe we'll check that out this time. We'll see. Oh, yeah, the assassins, dude. Ooh, careful, these guys, man. Dude, you're not being careful at all. All right, get to... Oh, God. Hide for a second. Gather your thoughts. And then snipe these fools in the face. Ready? Yeah. Hey, pal. Thought he was going to get that shot off. Assassins, I probably underneath. Oh, yeah. Drop in. Oh, fail. Boom. Pigeon, this is a really fun room, man. I don't give a shit that I uh, had to go through it three different times. It was... I really think this is a map. One, early on with this biome and seeing how things work and, and everything. This is a great map to show different styles with this. And out of all of them, I think ideally I would have liked to have come in with this kit right here, but with the floaties and like floated around and just like pop, 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 you know? Um, the trap keeping in is great. Your piston at the top of the ramp. I know I'm talking about this uh, before I'm out there, but I think also to save you guys some time. Mm, no, don't. Oh, man, Pigeon, you got something here, dude. This is really good. Uh, fire. There you unhand me. Ah, uh, <laughs> thank you. Never speak to me or my son again. Code Red, we're out of here. It's down here. Probably a uh, tomb, maybe? Mm, no, tomb, tomb. Yeah, I thought maybe you were, like, messing with me. Um, Not done yet. We still got a little bit more to get through. Wrong. Piston. Wait, have I gotten this far yet? No, I don't think so, right? What killed me? An assassin? Joe, you got to turn around, dude. <laughs> All right. I'm good at this time. There we go. Oh, I really got turned around there. What the heck? Why did I get turned around that much? Came from here and then... It's really odd to me. Oh, did I, did I go low and just get... Yeah, that's what it was. Okay. That looks nice. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be fun to mess with those dudes. I bet you'll be able to make them do some crazy shit. 
Um, that's two assassins, two assassins. There's there's definitely room for more. How many flyers? Four flyers. Uh, no brutes. Four shotgunners in total. What's that count to? Oh, yeah, you did this last time. That's how you died. That was cool, though, right? Plug and head. Be at peace, brother. Look at this combination of stuff. Yeah, this looks nice. All right, let's get out of here. There was a moment where I thought he had he did that on purpose to drain me out of these, so like assassins come up and I would have a harder fight. And I'm wondering if there's some kind of application there. Um, I covered a little bit of it in there, but I want to go through it real quick again. Uh, this looks really amazing. This looks like a frozen nuclear plant um, that's kind of got the remnants of whatever was left over the tech and in, in this kind of derelict state with, you know, people that were in storage for maybe a, hey, if anyone does come back here, drop these guys in. It's a really fun base uh, to attack. Um, once you get that and you have that fight in the immediate thing, I think that's definitely one of those, like, float around. Um Oh, could you imagine? Um, I think right off the bat, it's cool. This made me think, oh gosh. And then, I, I mean, really, it was that close, you know, where I'm like, what the hell does this do? And then it was like, this could have been really bad. Um, the shotgunners were excellent. I love that new spread. Um, I haven't really seen that yet um, in a lot of the bases, probably because most people kind of took them off or aren't following that, you know, the spread's been changed back to, or not back, but to a better spread than it was. Um, those guys are kind of viable again, which is cool. Uh, the I'm trying to think if there was any thing I'd change, and there really isn't. The lasers were cool. It felt pressured. I, you know, they fire a lot. Fat. They do that mm, like, and they're b -b -b like they're starting. You can still, you know, it's still like maybe two or three seconds in total, but it, it feels faster. It puts that pressure on you. I had to go. Okay, well, I still would have had time, but it felt like it was firing right off the bat. Um, the bombs. That's dumb that I missed those. I, I kind of was like, you deserve to get bombed by that, but I just must have done a weird maneuver. And I think that's a really good spot for it. So there's really nothing here that um, I think... That's pretty far in there, huh? What the hell? Wait, did... Wait, you were playing the beta too, Pigeon? I didn't know that. That's so funny. What made me come in here? I don't know why. I just thought I should try. This is really cool. I would have missed this, too. Man, I wonder how many other... Oh, can I get out of here? Oh, you totally can, man. That is awesome. Wait, I'm going up. That comes right back, though. Is there nothing up that way? That's nothing. Does that go anywhere? Seems to go... Oh, but there's nothing to grab on. Where does that go? Oh, shit. Am I just firing up in the air? Oh, my God. I'm actually... Okay, listen. I'm a little special. Um, we're going to ignore that last part. Uh, me, you know, getting rid of half my salva up into the air that probably... Could you imagine if it came back down and killed me? Oh, man. Deck of death of the season right there. Um, this is amazing. I would, I would say fun. No. Artistic fun. Ingenious, deadly, or brutal. Um, I love the little uh, sneak spot in here. This was excellent, but you really you went above and beyond coloring everything with this. I mean, he went through every part pretty much and colored this up to keep it on theme, and it really looks like this huge, uh, like Eastern Bloc kind of brutalism structure that was just meant to power. You know, what's that game where you like build around a heat source in the the north? It's like a city builder. This reminds me a little bit of that. I think you did a great job with that theme, Pigeon. And uh, it's crazy that this is even, like, marked up 10. You can barely see it. We're going to have to, like, really walk up on it. But great job on this. If you guys want to check it out yourself, it is Pigeon Chest. And it is blank. Um, so just guess. It's Brighton. I'm just kidding. Um, Brighton by Pigeon Chest. Well done, dude. Love that one. I don't care that this was super long. It was worth it.